Hi, I'm Nicole Scott with Mobile Geeks here at the Lenovo pre-event to CES and I have a new portable tablet. It's a little big, but it's actually meant for at home. This is the Lenovo Horizon 2. It's 15 pounds, so I'm going to put it down right now in a very gentle way. And then on the back, there's just a little lever. Oh, I'm going to get some help. There we go. And then it kind of goes into a desktop mode, right? So you can kind of do TV stuff on here. It's a Windows-based PC. You can flip around for pictures. But the interesting part is when you lay it down. I, I just push it down. OK. So when you lay it down, so here we go. So this is meant to be a tabletop PC, right? It's, it's very thin for <laughs> how big it is. It has the fourth generation Core i7, the U series, so it's a mobile processor. Uh, it also comes with an NVIDIA GeForce GTX, the 800 series. It's only 19.5 millimeters thick, which I think is pretty good for something that gives you four hours of battery. It's actually not meant to watch TV on the subway, clearly, <laughs> but you are meant to kind of uh, create like a sharing experience at home. So one of the things that I really do like about it is if you have uh, the app on your Android device, yeah. well, let's, we'll, we'll start with one, and then kind of like, whoosh, I wish there was a sound effect for that because it just looks so cool. And then what happens is, is it's reading the device, and then you can have photos directly from the device. So here we go, detecting the phones. So it does multiple handsets as well. The display is actually 2560 by 1440, and it's a 10-point multi-touch. So you can see that the individual photos from each of the phones has come up. So you can actually search. And say I would like this photo onto this device. I can share that. Oh, oh I'm not sharing that over. Yeah. Oh, in the center. So you can actually share the photo into their phones. So you can kind of do some like multimedia sharing. And I'm sure that you've seen the, the original Horizon that was released last year. This is an improvement on it in terms of, um, I think, design and build quality as well. If you kind of spin around to this side over here, you can see that there's, there's a variety of ports on here. So you can kind of have like a desktop replacement. We have HDMI, uh, three USB 3.0s. There's a headphone jack there. And that would be the PSU. So like I mentioned, it does give you four hours of battery. Along the bottom, we don't have much else. Around the other side, we have the power and the volume rocker like would be on any tablet. So we're going to uh, play a new game. Can you load that, that new yeah, fun sure. game? Sure. Uh, I've gotten quite good at this game, so I kind of want to show off. Yeah. All right. The traditional board game. So you can, see, yeah, yeah. So you can see that there's Clark actually game. there's 16 games right now. Uh, actually, we get uh, uh, more than 500. More than 500? So that you can download it uh, from the, our online uh, store. Mm. Yeah. Let's try the clock. This is a traditional board game. So this is like very, very much replacing the, the board game at home. Yeah, so it's, right. And it's interactive, and so it's, it's very much for the, the whole family experience. So the idea is that you can, um, well, th for this one, the colors come up in the center, and then we're going to compete any for any star. star. Yeah. I'm doing a terrible job. Oh. If you're looking for the ultimate kind of all-in-one with a lot of versatility around the home, this offers you a lot of really good design statement and a lot of, you know, interactive and fun activities around the house. So this is the Lenovo Horizon 2. It goes for $12.99. It should be going on sale in the near future. It, uh, it goes up to one gigabyte of storage, eight gigabytes of RAM, and it's got an NVIDIA GTX graphics card in it. Really, what more can you ask if you want something that's high power, high performance, and is a little different at home? I'm Nicole Scott from Mobile Geeks. Yeah.